everyone, I'm Alejandra from Alejandra.tv and in this video I'm going to show you how to organize your coffee table inside your living room or your family room. But first, if you're looking to get organized, you can check out my free organizing video series on my website Alejandra.tv. The link is below. Okay, so one of the problems with um, organizing your coffee table is you don't have a lot of space and it's a, it's, um, you might have a lot of things, not a lot of space, and it's a common space, it's a common room that everyone in the house uses, so you're kind of setting up a system for everyone to use, not just like one person. So let me show you what I do here. So I, instead of a coffee table, I have a storage ottoman that serves as the coffee table also, but has storage inside to kind of maximize space. So um, on top here, I just have like photo books and there's coasters, and really that's it. Um, the purpose of like not putting a lot of stuff was because it's a storage ottoman and sometimes we're taking, you know, the top part off to get things to get to the things inside and so I didn't want to have a lot of things on top okay so one of the things I do to maximize space and get things off the table and onto the vertical space is use a remote control organizer um, that just hangs over the edge and it, the rest of it falls into the ottoman um, and so what I've done here is I've just velcroed this in place so it's not gonna fall um, but it contains all of the remote controls like on the side and then what I did on the back was I just labeled them with what they are so this is the TV one um, this one is not in use right now and it might sound like ridiculous to label the remotes but when there's like a million remote controls nowadays it gets really confusing if you aren't good with technology or you just don't have it memorized or if you have guests over or like a babysitter over or something and they want to watch television you don't have to like explain everything everything is labeled so it's kind of self-explanatory so I did that um, so now let me show you what's inside the coffee table and kind of go through um, you know, what kind of stuff we store inside. Okay, so inside the coffee table, um, I just have board games and photos. That's like the main purpose. That's like, the, yeah, the main purpose of the coffee table. So I store all of our board games um, vertically because they're easier to access as opposed to stacked. So I just come in here and I see exactly what games we have. Um, and I keep them in the family room because when we have friends over, sometimes we play board games. And so this is just the place that we play. So it just made the most sense. So they're stored vertically. Um, and what I do for some of the games that like, have a really like loose lid like the lid yeah it just doesn't stay on so I put a big rubber band just like this and so it just keeps the lid on so when I pull up the game it doesn't you know like pieces don't fall out and stuff and then for games where the box is kind of falling apart like this one right here I just put a clear packing tape along the edges so the box kind of stays intact um, and I use clear tape so it doesn't cover you know, the name of the game, even though you can obviously see what the name of the game, the game is. Okay, so one of the things that I do for some of the board games, not really all of them, um, but some of them, is put all the pieces in little plastic baggies just like this, um, just to make it easier to clean up and easier to, um, you know, to set up the game and stuff. It just makes it a little simpler. Okay. All right, so that goes there. And then over here, um, there's old photo albums. So I don't really put pictures in photo albums that much anymore. Um, so these are just older ones. Now I'm just using these photo boxes, which I talked about in another video. Um, and they're just stacked in here, nice and organized. And then whenever I print photos, I can just put them inside here. Or if they're bigger photos, I put them on the side down here. So how do you organize your coffee table? Do you have a storage ottoman or do you just have a traditional coffee table? Leave a comment below and let us know. And if this is your first time watching any of my videos, you can subscribe for more tips on getting organized or check out my website, alejandra.tv. Thanks for watching and I'll see you soon. Bye.